on the high side. Look at that. He, he's not fooling no one. Well, you said that uh, he wasn't running no power. You said he was running power. He showed you barefoot and he showed you kick on. But the bottom line is that man's a bum. You know it as well as I do. And if whoever wants to fight for Richie, hey, just stand in line. But remember, the truth always comes out. And Richie's been exposed for the crackhead and the fraud that he is. And he likes to beat on women. But anyway, enough been said and enough been told. All the proof is on video. How I crushed Richie three blocks away. A mobile. Just look at the video. The hole that just got filled. Mr. Birdman himself put it up for you. Right, it did any of you. <laughs> And in my side of the video, Birdman can't even break my noise level barely. Is that three blocks away? I don't think so. He's mad. Nobody's going to argue with him. He's mad when Richie hit and run. Like I'd always been, Q, I never had a problem with you. You don't have one with me. Let's keep it like that. But when people jump in front of Richie, they... Don't let him pussy up. I got no beef with you, and you with me, so we'll just keep it like that. And uh, like I said, to Richie's followers, all the truth comes out. Sweet, and it has. Tell him to Richie you're no beef at all, so stop it. In his own words, Dollar Vanzo, cursing him out of all day and trying to run him over, in his own words. But I'm just out here to provide truth and justice the American way. To expose the fraud so they don't become victims. That's all I'm out here for, to provide truth and justice. The American way. <laughs> Listen close to Enforcer's breathing, you know what crack smokers sound like.
Richie does not know what you're talking about. Richie don't get involved in calling agencies or sending them anywhere. Richie's a fucking cop. So patiently waiting for one of you motherfuckers to come off the mic and try to get stupid and try to take it to the next level. There ain't no beef or battle out here behind the mic. I'm clear. I don't respect, I don't respect it as a snitch rat. Not in my book. Guys are no good at making them lies. People's uh, putting out thumbnails of people's families, their mothers, their fathers, their relatives, sending AC ACS to people's house, sending mail subscriptions. All right, ACS and mail subscriptions are at me, but exposing the fraud that you are and putting who you are out there and showing you what happens when you come out here trying to create lies and havoc and uh, create problems. Yeah, I think I did a fine job. Real fine job. Yeah, who was that, Jay? Evening time. I heard you before, man. It's just uh, the crackhead was keen up on you. See? See? Crackhead. I, again, he wants to convince y'all I'm his crack-smoking buddy. Imagine that. Agency to someone's house claim that their child is being abused, and meanwhile the men don't even have kids. I mean, uh, you know. You're taking that to another level. That's not just going back and forth on the radio. Well, I'm sure the agency that got those calls and I'm sure the officers that investigated know exactly where those calls came from. And I'm sure they'll assure you it didn't come from Richie or anywhere on Brooklyn soil. <laughs> He chose. He chose to do what he does and do what he did. And no one put a gun. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. These guys chose to start a war they couldn't finish, and the only fraud that got exposed out here was them and them family. Everything they say about Richie's pure lie. Richie's not a crackhead. Richie's not a junkie. Richie don't have the disease. Richie don't have the monster. Richie's highly skilled at radio work. Richie's a very decorated undercover cop with all the right information on all the wrong people. If you really want to know why this is happening, the king of New York breaking it down just like that, man. Yeah, I believe that, man. I believe that also. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I believe that. Now that I believe that, I got something else I can repeat and spread rumors about. Yeah, I can believe that. But their family did the right thing in life, and uh, they were taken away from us. But, you know, I, I believe they're rewarded because their time here of suffering is over. That's how I look at it. But then you got the, uh, the K2 man. You know, he's just here. If you want to know what crackheads sound like, listen to this man's breathing be during his speeches. That's what crack smokers sound like, to be point blunt. Anyway, it's good talking to you, man. It's good hearing you out there. As long as the channel's not too crazy, I hear you fine, man. Well, if you are on your own channel 22, you wouldn't have to worry about it. You come to 31 and make chaos and make crazy, we take everything out your radio, boy. Yeah, yeah, that's what it is. You know, that, that, that's, that's what's up. That's what's up. Uh, you're uh, in the same, you know, same general area. Oh, yeah. Wow, and how do you hear me, all right? You don't hear him now. They carry on me. Alright, hey, hey, You don't hear him now. One thing in communication I always live by. Scrush. If I'm doing a five or a twenty. Tell him stop smoking. When it goes out there. Smoking K2 and crack, he can't step on Richie. To someone ten blocks away, man, that's not my style. 
you hear me with five watts, five hundred milliwatts, or or hundred. He stopped spending his money on drugs. He'd be able to put it on his table, right? You know what I'm saying? I don't want to sound like a preacher out here, but you know what I'm talking about. Oh yeah, Nitro and Enforcer, the right ones. Mr. EDP and Mr. Storyteller. Wow, listen to how much in the noise level Mupcake is. Check my side, check the two-sided gate, check my morning 19 gate, and when you could hardly hear Birdman, try and believe he was three blocks away. You could check it out, it's called the hole that just got filled, and you'll see how it destroyed him. Yeah, you could go to Birdman's page or, uh, or CK, it's, it's, it's on one of them. The hole that just got filled, and uh, sit back and have a good laugh. Don't forget, my 5 watts against Richie's 800. Don't, don't forget that. Stark against power. In his neighborhood versus me, uh, not even in the same borough, man. That's embarrassing. Now I hear Richie getting, going for a newer amp with uh, dual three Z500s.